What made it cursed? What if speed had a price? That's the mystery we're diving into today as we take a first look at the so-called cursed alloy of the A6M0. When this Japanese fighter appeared in the skies during World War II, it shocked the world. Pilots and engineers everywhere were stunned by how light, how fast, and how agile it was. At first glance, the Zero felt almost unbeatable, and that's exactly where the story begins. A first look that stunned everyone. When we first look at the A6M0, it doesn't seem possible that a fighter this large could move so smoothly. The secret was its special aluminum alloy designed to cut weight wherever possible. This metal helped the Zero reach speeds over 330 miles per hour, which was impressive for its time. It could turn tighter, climb faster, and fly farther than many enemy planes. Early in the war, this gave Japanese pilots a serious edge, and for a while, the Zero ruled the skies. The Hidden Cost of Lightness But as we look closer, we start to see why this alloy earned its dark reputation. To stay light, the metal lacked proper protection. There was very little armor, and the fuel tanks were not well shielded. This meant that even a few bullets could cause massive damage. Once Allied pilots learned this weakness, everything changed. One solid hit could tear through the airframe, and fire spread fast. The same metal that made the Zero amazing also made it fragile. A Legacy Written in Metal In the end, the cursed alloy of the A6M0 tells us a powerful story. It shows how pushing technology too far in one direction can come at a heavy cost. The Zero remains one of the most famous fighters ever built, not just for its victories, but for the lessons it taught the world. Speed and agility are powerful, but survival matters just as much. That balance, once broken, can change history.